So hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So as you go, as as you know, or as lots of you know, I've actually been waiting on a specific Amazon order and it actually came today, which is two days early. So thank you Amazon for that. There was actually a lot of like backup with orders and stuff because we had a big snowstorm and um yeah but the thing that i ordered finally came so like i said you probably already know what it is and it is a crochet hook set and it came with a bunch of little accessories and hooks it came with a bunch of different hooks it came with some sorry there's like a hair on my desk um but there are a bunch of different accessories and there are economic e economic hooks probably saying that wrong but they have like grips so that when you're crocheting um it's gonna be a lot better for your hand and it'll give you less cramps so that's why i got this and there's actually some like stitch markers and stuff in here as well i'm pretty sure um but yeah so first impression i really like the case and it has like this really like nice brown tassel and I really like that. It's just very simple, and I like simple. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and I guess do some overview with my tripod so that you guys can really see what I'm gonna be doing with my hands. All right, so now you guys can see my hands. So, sorry if my area's a little bit messy. Well, it's not right over here, but over there. I've been working on some designs, so um, that's that. But let's get right on into opening this. Okay, so it's nice and compact, which is something that's really great. And it comes with this little thing. And I guess it shows everything that it comes with or something. I'm going to open it because I don't really know what this is. Sorry for all the crinkling if you don't like crinkling. All right. All right, so I guess this kind of shows everything that it has in it. So it has some like tapestry needles, it has different hooks, and little measuring tape, stitch markers it looks like. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna get right on into looking and seeing what's inside of here. I'm so excited. Um, all right, so these are the like grip hooks I was talking about. I'll have to see how many sizes of them there are because they're supposed to be a wide range. Um, which is great because I like you being able to use a lot of different hooks sizes. Then there's also these metal ones. And I don't think they're like specifically like a boy brand or anything like that. But I do like the colors. Very nice. And then I think there's even more hooks. What are these? Okay, there are some like one millimeter hooks. I guess if you do like tiny amigurumi. So these are really itty bitty. They're actually like, they're not even as big as my hand. So they're really small compared to the regular crochet hook. They're really tiny. And that's in the bag. And then there's also this package. So this comes with some like super big stitch markers as well as like these regular ones. I've actually never had these little like regular stitch markers before so I'm like so excited to try these out. It also came with a ruler and tapestry needles. So I'm gonna go ahead and start um, with I guess the crochet hooks because I feel like these are just you know they're just pieces of metal for like hooks and it's just a ruler so we can open this later. Um. I want to start with these though because I've never ever had hooks like these before. So they came like really nicely packaged, which is great. Um, and yes, there will be a link for this in the description below if you guys want to go ahead and, you know, get it <laughs> for yourself. Um, these look really nice. All right. I'm just going to go ahead and open them. Oh, 
Oh my God. And right away, these feel so great to the touch. Okay. So it looks like they have a really great variety of sizes. And I also love that each of them is a different color. So I think this is probably, I think, I don't know which one's the biggest size. I think this goes all the way to like a six millimeter hook. So this is the six millimeter. And then the smallest one, I'm pretty sure, this is a 2.5 millimeter hook. I love the way these feel. I'm actually gonna try out some crocheting with these. But these all feel really nice and comfortable to the touch. And they all come in different colors. So it starts off at a size two millimeter and goes all the way to size six. So it's a good handful of hooks. And I really, I do like the sizing though because these are probably really great for like amigurumi projects. Um, if you wanna make, you know, some smaller and some bigger. Um, I don't think these would be good for like a chunky yarn, but I do think if it's like a weight medium like four kind of yarn, I think these will be really great. So for like a thickness maybe of like, like kind of this kind of yarn maybe. So maybe this kind of yarn, maybe a little bit thicker than that. Um, but I really like how these feel. They're really nice too. Like you can really feel like they're not flimsy, like they're metal. Um, and they are really, they roll all over the place. Um, but I do, they do feel like really good. They're like, they feel like metal. Um, so that's great. <laughs> all right. So I put those hooks to the side. Now I'm going to get started with these hooks. And I think these hooks go to a different, like, a, um, a bigger size. So they, like, end probably at, like, um, I don't know exactly what kind of hook. Maybe probably, like, an 8 millimeter. they probably end at. Because these ones definitely, like, bigger. They look a lot bigger. But, oh, this is a size 9 millimeter hook. So this is great for, like, chunky yarn, probably. I've never really used chunky yarn other than for one blanket I made a while ago. All right. So these hooks, they go all the way up to a 10 millimeter sized hook. So this is really great. And they're definitely not, they're definitely metal. Like they're not plastic. Um, they're, they feel really nice. Um, they come in like really nice metallic-y colors. So I love that. And then I think they go all the way down to, let's see what size they go down to. I think this is the smallest one. This is a two millimeter hook so very itty bitty uh, but wow i'm honestly very impressed with these like they have all the sizes like nailed <laughs> um i want to also open up these ones because i've never touched these itty bitty hooks before ever this tiny so i'm pretty excited for this um Oh my god, they're so tiny. I'm not going to touch all of them just because I kind of feel like it's not necessary because they're all around the same size. They range from like one millimeter to like two millimeter. So this is 1.0 millimeter. And then this one's like 1.30 millimeter. So they kind of go up just by a little bit each time. Um, I'm kind of like, I'll try to show you like the difference between the two. Like, it's a very slight, but you can really see the difference. You can, Well, I mean, you can't exactly see the difference, but it does look significantly like... This one kind of looks a little bit fatter than this one. So, um, yeah, those are the hooks. I love the sizes. I think, they think, I think they're great. I'm actually going to go ahead and put these just in this because, I mean, it is a case... For the hooks so i'm just gonna go ahead and put them in i'm gonna also go ahead and put these um colorful ones in and they all fit really nicely like look how much room there's in there still man it's a lot of room all right so these hooks, I'm going to go ahead and put them there. And 
And now I'm going to show you the accessories. There's a lot of plastic in this, though, so I'm going to probably have to, like, throw out a lot of the plastic after this. But inside of here, there's, like, oh, that's interesting. Hold on. So, looks like this ruler is also a measuring tool for, like, hooks. So you can go ahead and, I guess, pick a hook. So this is a size 3.5 millimeter. So I guess if you, you could try putting in there, except I don't think you're supposed to put it in from the tip. So I guess this is a six and a half millimeter. I don't know if this does halves, but um, yeah. Okay, so let's see. I'll see if I can find one that it might actually go in. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay, so this is a four millimeter hook. So we're gonna go down to the four right here. And I guess maybe this is for knitting needles or something, but you're supposed to be able to like stick it through the hole. I guess you can't do that. I, know, I thought you would be able to do that. I guess I was wrong. I don't know exactly what this is for. I guess, oh, it says knitting gauge. Yeah, so it's for knitting needles. Um, but it also has centimeter count on the side so i guess if you're making something around six inches long this is good um but and i think this also maybe does some inches on this side to like five and a half so that's really great but this is a little ruler all right the next thing is these like sewing needles or like knitting needles so these are good for Threading your yarn through and then you can easily sew really nicely and it's great because these are not like the itty bitty ones or like the super skinny ones they use for like sewing. These are great for yarn because they are nice and thick and they'll actually go through your stitches a lot better and you can actually hold them and like not poke yourself because they're not that sharp. Um, and these came in a bunch of different sizes so there's like some smaller ones and some thicker ones. That's great. It also came in this really cute case that you can just pop the lid off and on of, off and on of, uh, nah, 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 nah. that did not make sense. Then there's this like, I guess, huge thing. If you're making like huge amigurumi, then you might wanna like do that to stick your stitches. It's like a stitch marker. And then there was this smaller one, which I think is also great. I love the color of this, it's really pretty gold. And then there's the classic stitch markers. I've never used one of these before and I'm so excited to actually have them now. Um, but I'm just gonna like, I just wanna see how it works because I've never used these. Wow, that's really nice. Oh, okay, these are really nice. I like the colors of them too. Not that that really matters, but I guess sometimes when you're crocheting, with the colors that you like, it's kind of a little bit more pleasing to the eye. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I really like these hooks from this case. And the main reason I got this was because I really, really, really wanted to try out these hooks. And I've never used these hooks before. I'm actually going to go ahead and try crocheting some stuff with these. And I'm going to do a little sample. Um, I'm going to grab like a 5 millimeter hook. So let's see. It's 3.3. I'm just grabbing all the wrong sizes. All right. Um, 4.5. Where's the 5 millimeter? 4 millimeter. <laughs> um, it's too tiny. All right, here's the... This is 5.5. Close enough to 5 millimeter, right? So, I'm just going to go ahead and crochet up a little bit with this. I'm just going to use this blue yarn matching. And I'm just going to crochet up a little square. I'm not actually going to make anything too big, though, just because I want to show you guys a little sample of this. And then I'm going to end the video off. So, I'm going to go ahead and crochet a little sample, and I'll be right back. All right. So, I'm back. Um, I didn't crochet too big of anything. I just did... I just chained 12 and then did half double crochets back but I really like how it 
I'm, I love how the hook feels. It feels great to use. And I'm just going to go back now. And you guys can kind of see how I'm doing it. But I love how it feels on, in the hand. Um, it's a little bit, you know, bigger to kind of hold on to. So it might get used to. You might have to, like, really get used to it. But my hand doesn't hurt. Like, when I'm do as I'm doing this, I'm really noticing that my hand does not hurt as much as it does when holding a regular, like, just skinny hook without the, like, grippy thing. <laughs> I know they're called something, but, like, I just don't know what it's called. And I've been saying, like, teeny a lot. I don't know why. <laughs> but... I really like how this feels, so, yeah, um, although this does, this kind of yarn does use a 5 millimeter hook typically, um, and I'm using a 5.5 millimeter hook, so not that big of a difference, um, but yeah, I really like this hook, and I think you should go down below and, you know, get it, if you want to get it. So, that's it for the review today, I hope you enjoyed me looking through these hooks, and, you know, I'm actually going to probably be using these a lot in some of my future crochet tutorials. Um, be prepared. My next crochet tutorial will be these ice creams. I'm going to be making them in two separate videos just because this one's taking a long time to film. But, yeah. So, yeah, I recommend... You will check those out when they're out, and subscribe to my channel if you're new here. I do lots of crochet, a little groomy kind of stuff, and, uh, yeah. So, comment down below what you want to see next, if you want to see any specific crochet tutorials, if you want me to do any more, like, fun review stuff, kind of like this, and, yeah, I'll be see you guys in the next one. Bye!